welcome to Cheeky Crumbs. Today we're going to be making a super yummy, delicious, but simple Japanese dessert. It's a dorayaki, I think I'm saying that right. And it's basically two pancakes sandwiched together with a filling. Usually it's red bean paste, but today we're going to be putting Nutella inside. And this is also Doraemon's favorite food. And when I was a kid, I used to love watching Doraemon. I watched it all the time. And when I traveled to Japan and I saw these, I ate loads of them. So I thought, why not try and make them at home? So let's get started. What you're gonna need, two dots. For your pancakes, you'll need 150 grams of flour, two teaspoons of honey, two eggs, 65 grams of sugar, 50 ml of water, one teaspoon of vanilla essence, one and a half teaspoon of baking powder, and for the filling, I'm gonna be using some Nutella. To start, we're gonna make our pancake batter. In a large enough bowl, you want to crack your eggs. And your sugar, and we're gonna cream them together using our handheld mixer. Now you want to add your baking powder to your flour and we're gonna add half of it to the mixture and using a little whisk we're just going to incorporate that. Now we're gonna add the rest of our flour and baking powder mixture. Now you want to add in your vanilla, the water and honey. and you want to give it a good mix. Now you want to um, cover your bowl with some cling film and place it in the fridge for 30 minutes to cool down and rest. Nap time. Now that your pancake batter has been resting, you want to get a non-stick pan and to put just a little bit of uh, cooking oil and we're gonna heat this. Now using a kitchen paper, you just wanna wipe the excess off. And here is our batter. You wanna give it a nice mix. Now you're gonna take your batter, about two tablespoons, and you're gonna pour it into your pan. Now you want to let this cook on low heat until um, bubbles start appearing on the top, and then we're gonna flip it over. Now you want to take it off the heat and put it on a little plate. My first ones were a little big, so I started making them smaller and they're actually much cuter. 
So on really low heat, just pour in my batter and then they spread as they cook. So I've cooked all of my little dorayaki, they're so cute. And as you can see, the first one I made is uh, huge mungus. So I made the first one, realized it was way too big. So the other ones, I made them a little smaller and cuter and yeah. So now we're ready to fill them. You wanna try and pair them up. So for example, like these two have more or less the same size and these two and so on. So that you don't have like a big and a smaller one and what you want to do is get your Nutella get a nice spoonful and you want to place it in the middle like that spread it just a little bit and then you're gonna take your other side and press them together and you wanna press the edges down to make it like a little summit. Oh, we have some oozing Nutella. That's never a bad thing though. And here it is, our little Dorayaki. So here they are, our Nutella Dorayaki. And I love the fluffiness of the pancake and the Nutella oozing out and the golden on the top and they just look so cute and delicious. And now let's eat one. Mm. Best kind of sandwich. Look how fluffy that is. Mm, that's so good. Mm. So I hope you enjoyed my video and if you did, give me a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought and what you would like to see me make in my future videos. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and I'll see you next time. Bye!